Katsina kidnap. Leave your cows. Seek help. Easy quickly. Blast Buare. A former presidential aspirant, Obi Ezekwisili, has told the President Major General Mohamed Buhari to leave his cows and walk towards rescuing the kidnapped Katsina students. Students numbering over 300 were kidnapped from the Government Science Secondary School in Kankara by Boko people. Writing on Twitter, Ezekwiski lamented that such kidnap could occur while Nigerian is yet to account for 112 Chibo girls kidnapped by Boko people six years ago. She wrote, President Bowie should leave his cows for once in preference for the lives of his fellow human beings. It is inhuman for a supposed leader of a country to be as uncaring as you are to the latest cries of parents of 333 Kankara boys. Why are you so inhuman, Buhari? The outrage I feel about the tragedy of Kankara boys cannot be vocalized. That six years after Chibo girls with 112 still unaccounted for, that two years after Dapchi girls with Leif Shaibu still unaccounted for. Now, 333 Kankara boys abducted. The biggest shame on Buhari. What exactly is the grossly incompetent and coldly indifferent Buhari really doing in Katsina State? Why disconsolate parents of 333 Kankara boys cry their eyes out. Does the president know more than we have been told about? About the whereabouts of those students. In October, US military forces rescued their one citizen held hostage by Boko people within our territory. Rory, as commander in chief of Nigerian Army, should please accord highest priority to the lives of 333 Kankara students and seek U.S. support immediately. Thank you for listening to this news. Perfect. Simple and short. Simple and uh, intelligent. What an intelligent construction. Can you imagine? I love this. I love this. Well, um, my viewers, this is a very perfect message from Obi Ezekwisili to President Mohamed Pouari. That is, if he will listen. If he will listen, because it's not the listening type. It's not the type that pays attention to, to advice. It's not the type. It's not the type that heed to advice. It's the type that always believe on his own idea. is too rigid. Too rigid in opinion. Can you imagine? 333 students mm -hmm. abducted in your own hometown. Yet you can you 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 you, you, you didn't feel any remorse, you didn't feel the cold. Even as a president of a country, you didn't feel it that your country is on fire. That three hundred thirty-three people are about to be leaving your country illegally. And you did not feel the cold. You didn't feel the cold. Look at America, according to Obi Ezekwisli. Just one, one soul that, 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 um, that, that is almost leaving their country. They went after, after him and got him back within 24 hours. 
But here we are talking about 333. Instead of you to pay attention to it, you are paying attention to your cows. It means that you, President Mulberry, has taken your cows to be more important than the lives of people. Why are Fulanis so heartless? Why are some, some Fulanis so heartless? Why are they so heartless? Why? Fulanis don't play with their cows. They are ready to kill. They are ready to kill if you don't, if you don't, uh, if, if you joke with your cows. That is how they brutalize the, 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 the Southeasterners just because of cow. Yes, I'm telling you. So, according to Obi Ezekwisli, the president should seek foreign support, international support. He should seek um, uh, um, uh, uh, help from, from, um, from, from, from foreign countries. Let them go in search of these 333 school boys and bring them back to their parents. Bring them back to their parents. The Chibo girls that were abducted, over 112 of them, till date, we don't have account of them. The, um, the, uh, uh, the Dapchi girls, the Dapchi girls that was also abducted, we don't have account of them. Now it's 333. Why? Is there anything special that they are doing with these children? With these people? Is there anything special? Oh, shit. Hmm. But then, should we start asking ourselves questions if President Mumbari has anything doing with this, um, with this uh, abducted people? Or does he know anything about them? That is making him to mm -hmm. be handling this situation with so much levity. Eh? Mm -hmm. My viewers, I plead to you to raise your voice as well. Let us all raise our voice and make the president know that we are aware of what is going on. Do you understand? Let us cry out. Let us no, shout it out so that everyone will be aware. Do you understand? You can't, be, you can't be replacing your cows to human beings. For what? For what? May God have mercy on us. So, my dear viewers, what is your take and your advice? Please deem it fit to leave your comments below the comment box. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated whenever we mm -hmm. upload any new videos. Thank you.